Do you know why I hate tethering? It's not because AT&T charges me 40 some odd dollars a month. It's not because 3G isn't the fastest connection available. It's because the stupid tethering bar that's so ugly and you can't customize it whatsoever. I can't stand that thing. Now I can't wait for the day where you can fully customize this ugly little tethering bar at the top. But I know that day is very close because you can already customize it to a certain degree courtesy of a new jailbreak tweak called Tetherize. And I'm going to show you how that works right now. Now Tetherize, once it's installed, we'll put a settings section in your settings app. So let's just go back to our settings. And then you should see Tetherize right here. And this is a free jailbreak tweak available on Cydia. You can download that today. So once you have it installed, you'll see this settings section here and you can enable or disable the tweak. I'll go ahead and enable that. And then there are four default styles you can choose from. The first style is to hide the tethering bar altogether, which is a great option. I love that option. Then you have the option to change the text of the tethering bar and then remove the little vibrating, pulsating light, orb-like thing on the, uh, on the top there. You can just make it a solid blue, sort of. So you can do that, or you can just change the text, or you can just remove the pulsating light thingy there. So four options to choose from. I like the ability just to change the text. That's awesome in my opinion. So as you can see I've changed the text to just, well that's very original, just jailbreak movies, okay? I changed the tether bar text. Now to actually enable this change, what you need to do, you need to go back to your personal hotspot options and then just disable it and then re-enable it real quick like that. It doesn't have to be quick, just whenever you get a chance. And once you do that, you'll notice here at the top that the change will take effect. You'll have your text instead of the boring personal hotspot connection message. And there you go. That's how you customize your tethering bar at the top of your iPhone when you have native tethering on your iPhone. Remember, you need native tethering. I don't believe this works with MyY or any of those other options. So. So just keep that in mind. You're going to need to pay off that $45 a month in order to take advantage of to customize your little tethering bar up here. So once again, folks, you can download Tetherize for free on the Cydia store. It is available right now. And like I said, although there are only four customization options right now currently, no doubt the developer, as he says right here, there are loads of new styles coming up. So hopefully we'll see new colors. Oops, can you see that? Hopefully we'll see new colors. We'll see maybe a change to the dimensions of the tethering bar. And we'll see additional little styles and tweaks you know, available for tethering. So again, have you tried Tetherize? Like I said, it's available for free on the Cydia store. Let me know what you think in the comments section. This is Jeff with jailbreakmovies.com. Have you ever wondered how you can remove all those background apps that are just hogging up your iPhone's memory quick and easy? Well, there is a quick and easy solution, and that solution is an SP settings toggle and a jailbreak app called Remove Background. Check out this video.